The current size of the national herd in Ireland requires around 400,000 heifer calves per year. Using conventional semen to generate heifers results in roughly the same number of male dairy calves, which is a sustainability challenge for the dairy sector. Sex semen has the potential to help us deal with this sustainability challenge by generating the heifers required and only a small proportion of low value dairy breed bull calves. In the past, sex semen use was low because the number of bulls that were available sexed was small and they were usually not the best EBI bulls. In September 2021, Sexing Technologies set up a lab in Moore Park to provide sex semen for the Irish AI industry from the best bulls. The interest and uptake from farmers in 2022 led to a second lab being set up in November of that year to cater for the growing demand for sex semen. Now we're in a great situation where the best bulls are available sexed and farmers can select a large team of high EBI bulls to generate all their replacement heifers. Now is the time for a major shift in farm breeding practices. One, farmers should use high EBI sex semen on their highest EBI and most fertile dams at the start of the breeding season. This will facilitate accelerated genetic gain in their replacement heifers. Two, farmers should use high DBI beef semen on all other dams from the very first day of the breeding season and at all repeat heats to generate more valuable non-replacement beef calves. On top of the accelerated genetic gain and improvement in the beef calf crop, there are other obvious management and rearing benefits to having all of the heifer calves born together at the start of the calving period. And this is true whether they're rearing them at home or going to a contract rearer, as it ensures a uniform group of 15-month-old heifers at first breeding. In order to meet the current requirement for replacement heifers, the total number of dairy sex semen straws that would need to be used is around 800,000. In 2023, we will potentially get to around 30 to 35% of that target, which is fantastic progress in such a short period of time. Despite this progress, farmers need to continue to increase adoption of sex semen usage on their farms over the next number of years to improve the sustainability credentials of the dairy sector.